Live at Longreach High School with uh, Jay Run and Dean from PwC. Brizzy boys out here in Longreach. How are you guys doing today? Yeah, very well, thank you. Yeah, really good. Awesome. Uh, so you guys did a workshop today, um, and we're here to sort of give give the audience a bit of overview on what happened um, and what type of projects are you working on. Yeah. So what happened today? Uh, we're out here today kicking off a um, a project with. Uh, McGregor State High and Longreach High are coming together, um, defining problem statements for Longreach and surrounding communities. These problem statements are going to find their way into curriculum for the McGregor High students, so real problems from real community members uh, going into a process to, to try and get solved. Yeah, does that cover it? Yeah, I this think is more so. your thing, man. Yeah, no, I think so, and, and really, it's an opportunity for um, you know M McGregor and, and and people in Brisbane to. Uh, the students at, at McGregor to to solve you know real world problems that that the communities in Queensland are facing. So it's a really exciting opportunity, and we're, we're excited to be a part of it. Great. So what types of the discussion topics came out of this this morning? Like, what was the process? Because I heard a lot of um, it was great structure. So what what are you bringing to the table? How how did this event? Well, maybe I can talk to the yeah. pro the, the process. So the, um, we, we took on a sort of collaborative design process. So what was really important was getting actual community members, people from council, uh, business owners, the students themselves, all together in the same room and sort of starting to think about what are some of the problems. So today was not about solving, it was about defining some of those problems. Uh, and, and we worked collaboratively, individually, in groups and sort of had a really good discussion and at the end of it have come up with a series of problem statements that can go into the process. In terms of what we came up with though, yeah, and I think um, uh, just as, as a bit of background, I, I spent a little bit of time with PwC here on a project um, working with the health service and, and in amongst that we got to meet lots of great people uh, and, and really start to understand some of the challenges that are faced I in this community and, and things that you know our city folk have, have never in our wildest uh, dreams would kind of imagine the types of uh, the challenges and, and also the opportunities that are out here and so uh, taking that back um, have a, a relationship with, with McGregor State High School as, as an ex-student and I thought it's a really nice opportunity to link the two organisations together um, and, and, and bring you know bring everyone on, the, on that journey. Awesome and so what were the some of the key problems that these this group came up with and then uh, you know what was the next step after that? Oh, what, wait, one sec. What's that bird behind us? If you step out there. I don't famous. Know. Famous. What, what's this bird? What do you know? Nature. <laughs> <laughs> do you know the name of the bird? No. Uh, say again? Brolga. Brolga. Yeah. Awesome. Sorry, guys. The, we had interu wildlife <laughs> interruption. Yeah, exactly. Oh, great interruption. Awesome. So let's get back in frame. Yep. All good. Come on in a bit more. Okay, yeah, so where were we? So what type of problems were they? Yeah, so, so definitely keeping people in the community is an issue for them. So how do you encourage young families to stay or for that matter encourage, you know, people who are um, out in uh, on the coast or in the cities? How do they, how do you encourage them to come and live and work here? It's a big challenge to hold on. Yeah, and I suppose from here uh, the guys at McGregor will, will take it. There was a, about 15 or so problem statements uh, that were developed across a number of different um, I suppose categories, uh, infrastructure, sustainability, keeping people uh, in the community, uh, getting you know getting awareness around you know bringing people to to, to Longreach, and so uh, the guys at McGregor will take uh, that back with them, and, and they'll start building a, a curriculum for grade nine business uh, school students to try and solve and find an answer or a solution or a series of solutions uh, to that to that problem and I suppose that's where um, PwC will come in a little bit, will help um, kind of uh, mentor and coach and, and kind of uh, help with that, that process uh, and so yeah so we're, we're really looking forward to, to getting involved. This is probably the start of what's going to be a quite a long journey. Amazing and uh, is there any key takeaways that the audience could take from this um, to give them a bit of a overview, maybe inspire some other regions to take up this design thinking stuff? I, I, I think it's just amazing when you get community leaders in and ask them the question, they're just amazingly smart people. You know, they're connected, they're smart, uh, they're innovative. Um, what can be achieved when you actually bring them in and ask the right question uh, definitely surprised me today. Yeah. I suppose the other thing as well is that it's, it's phenomenal that uh, 
you know, the, the problems that we've come up with today are going to be solved by grade nine students. And, and we we're just saying in the session that they're inhibited by their in ab, in, 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 imagination. Uh, and so some of the ideas that, that are going to come out are hopefully going to be, um, you know, groundbreaking and they're going to be exciting. And, and, and it's going to be really, really interesting to see uh, the solutions that students come up with because uh, they, you know, not having um, the the challenges, seeing the challenges face to face, it almost gives them an opportunity to, to just come up with fresh and new ideas. Yeah, yeah, it's great. And it's it's, it's fresh mind to a different problems, exactly. right? Exactly. And they'll just continue to evolve and exactly. get better and better. Exactly. Well, thanks guys for joining us. Um, it is a lovely afternoon here in Longreach. We've got more interviews coming later on tonight at the launch of Startup Weekend, uh, Outback Edition, correct? At the hostel. Um, if you're in Longreach, definitely come down and check it out um, and keep watching at facebook forward slash beach city life uh, for more interviews and don't forget to check us out on youtube at beach city catch you later guys thanks for joining us thanks mate thanks, thanks, thanks a lot very much.